I'd like to show you one more article. Uh, you can start it in the same way as this one and stick around cake afterwards. Or you can weave a regular round bottom, place a heavy foam onto it, in this case it is a jar of honey, and weave these tubes of the base using the technique of spiral weaving with these very tubes. It is, uh, it is very important at the very beginning not to lose your way and it is convenient to fold every tube. Make sure not to miss any tube. Lead and down. Turn the next and down. In a similar way we used to turn up while passing from the bottom to the walls Here the technique is similar but downwards. Lead and downwards. This tube that was taken from the bottom we take and lead under the next one and do this way with every tube. The first row is the shaping one. Here there are a little more efforts, but I like the result. I've taken the tubes made of advertising paper, papers of Yeva store, store manufactured goods. When I made my first vars of them, I was delighted by its color. The basic color is orange. Look, I have passed to the next row already. Now I'm trying to press tighter to the form, continuing to weave in the same technique, turning every next tube behind the following one, but trying to press tighter to the form. In about the third or fourth row, I usually manage to press tight to the form. The main thing is not to lose any tube. Look what kind of weaving we get. It is the same spiral weaving, but the ribs are very close to each other. And the pattern looks completely different. Look one more time. The movements I make are somewhat different. I press with my finger. Take the next one, press. Try not to miss any tube. This vase cannot be called an express vase already. It presupposes more work due to the number of the poles, but the pattern comes out interesting. It is the way this pattern looks from inside. You can finish it in the same way as regular spiral weaving. Here we were weaving and it is where we have to hide the tube. If you cannot do it and assist it, help yourself with a skewer. Hide under the following pole. Now you can cover the edge with glue and cut in the same way as we were finishing our spiral weaving. The only difference is that uh, there were fewer working poles there, while here we have more of them. But it is going to hold anyway. <laughs>